Hello, I am Prithayan Barua. I am going to introduce our packed paper on cost driven threat coarsening for GPU kernels. We conducted some experiment to study the performance bottleneck in several OpenACC benchmarks and had some interesting observations. This chart shows the frequency histogram of the memory bandwidth utilized by 210 individual OpenACC kernels. For example, 9 kernels were able to achieve 90 to 100% of the available memory bandwidth. But 121 kernels, that is 60% of the total kernels, utilized less than 10% of the available memory bandwidth. This is clearly an issue and it seems like there is not enough work in each thread and this is an optimization opportunity. This is an OpenACC matrix multiplication kernel and we use the loop unroll and interleave transformation to improve the memory bandwidth utilization. This is a generalization of the thread coarsening transformation and after unroll and interleave, it increases the amount of work being done in each thread. So how does the transformation help? Here we see few kernels that provide 2 to 3x speed up after unroll and interleave. As we plot the increase in DRAM read throughput over these kernels, we can see that the DRAM read throughput increased by 3 to 4x and resulted in 2x speed up which validates our hypothesis. This chart shows the speed up on the left axis and the decrease in number of read transactions on the right axis. This is another interesting side effect of our transformation and some for of some of the kernels, the decrease in read transaction contributes to the speed up. For example, for the matrix multiplication kernel, there are 10 times fewer reads and it resulted in a 7x speed up. But the main problem is how to select the optimal unroll factor. This chart shows the significant difference in achieved speed up between different unroll factors and different kernels have different optimal unroll factor. In our paper, we reason about the number of concurrent transactions required to saturate the memory bandwidth and we come up with some heuristics to compute the optimal unroll factor. Please refer to our paper for more details. Thank you.